three immigration changes, in effect from July. In today's video update, we will talk about the top three changes in the UK immigration system that have come into effect from the 1st of July 2021. Before we continue with the video, be sure to enter into our brand new giveaway. We will give away any of these items it's your choice. To enter the giveaway leave a like, comment the keyword, subscribe and turn on the notification. And most importantly, watch the whole video. It's that simple. Brightest and the best. Changing the UK. UK. Single global immigration system. begin the video and talk about the UK graduate route. The new graduate immigration route, initiated for applications on the 1st of July 2021. The launch of the route is planned to build on the UK government's delivery of the new points-based immigration system, which began on the 1st of January 2021. The graduate route gives an opportunity for international students who have been allotted their degree to reside in the UK and work or look for employment at any skill level for two years, or three years for doctoral students. Please keep in mind that, the graduate route is unsponsored, denoting applicants do not require a job offer in order to be eligible. There is no minimum salary obligation, nor limits on numbers. Graduates on the route can work flexibly, switch jobs, and develop their career as needed. Whilst the route does not direct towards settlement, those individuals on the route, will be able to move into another work-based route, for example the skilled worker route, which does lead to settlement, after they fulfill the obligations. Applicants need to be in the UK, when they apply. Those who apply from outside of the UK, will be rejected and refused entry to the UK, and could lose their entitlement to apply for the graduate route as a whole. Because of the COVID-19, concessions are in position for students, not able to travel to the UK because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Applicants who commence their studies in autumn 2020, or spring 2021, will be required to be in the UK with permission as a student, by the 27th of September 2021. For more information, please visit the official GOV website. Link mentioned below. Now let's talk about the digital status. From the 1st of July 2021, European Union, European Economic Area, and Swiss citizens are required to prove their rights in the UK, with their immigration status, instead of their ID card, or passport. You can find more updates, on the links mentioned below. Lastly, let's talk about updates on right to work. After the change to employer right to work checks from the 1st of July 2021, please go through the official GOV.UK pages, which have been updated with the latest information. Link mentioned below, in the comments section and description box. Our video ends here. Please comment below and share your opinion with us. Thanks for watching.